This is Chris from Scientific Audiophile bringing you this breaking news. It seems that Golden Sound has publicly responded to DCS, who is threatening to sue him. From what I can gather, DCS hired Steve Acoustic to respond, not knowing that he's an idiot and used our Wi-Fi to transfer his response to them. I intercepted that response and I'm putting the unedited version on here. This is the breaking news you need to keep yourself informed. When this story ends, stay tuned for our second most important story. Trump is shot at a rally. As you have obviously heard, the evil golden scent. It, is the evil too strong? Okay, I'll have to take it out. As you have obviously heard, Golden Sound has publicly called out the small mom and pop British company, DCS, for simply trying to correct some factual errors. Instead of doing what they wanted, he put up not one, but two videos acting as if he was the victim. Well, here's a fact Golden Sound didn't tell you. Some of our employees have small children. Does he want them to starve because we can't sell a 15,000 pound DAC? Yeah, the bar talk isn't just a high-end DAC. It feeds children. The important thing to note is we haven't sued Golden Sound yet. We merely threatened him. Wait, you guys didn't pull that same shit as Tecton did, did you? Uh, not more than just like three months ago, you've been watching the news? Oh, shit. Well, maybe you should research that before I do this video. You're going down a rabbit hole, you might... Fine, I'll continue, but... I mean, you already paid me. Golden Sound made multiple errors, so let me enumerate them. He used measurements without any regard to the price of our product. It's... 15,000 pounds for God's sake. We priced it that high so our consumers would know how good it is. He stated only it has six filters. It has like a billion. Our product literature is crap. Golden Sound assumed our documentation was correct without contacting us in advance to confirm everything that we already documented was accurate. His fourth and greatest error and DCS wants to be extremely clear here because the first three errors can be forgiven was he didn't think the bar talk was worth the price DCS is 100% fine with reviewers screwing up as long as they say something like the best deck I've heard at this price seriously Golden Sound don't you know how to review a product wait I said that no I know that wasn't you sorry we're not going to argue about how Golden Sound's video was two years old when we first contacted him because we just told you earlier, we're a small shop. <laughs> Why did you guys say, wait so long to send that letter? <laughs> Your secretary's oldest child just married a lawyer and he's doing this pro bono? <laughs> you guys are rich. So if you want to support small businesses, it's time to help us take down big reviewers like Golden Sound, who wield power far greater than any one person in a democracy should. We don't need the Putin of audiophiles spewing hate for our, or any small company for that matter. You tell Golden Sound to take down his vendetta-based video about our Bartok DAC, and it's one of the best sub-20,000 DACs to ever grace this planet. Believe me, I haven't heard it, but it's 20K. And you'll feed a child while buying it as well. And this is Steve Acoustic, spokesman for DCS. Thank you, and have a blessed day.